Hello everyone, this is Daniel, and you're wondering, when is the rapture? Well, the rapture is in between today and I believe 2031. Um, well, and I'm not saying dates because obviously we know that 2048 is not the real date because that's like over 100 years for another date to happen. And 2031 seems to be very appropriate because, um, it's going to be before the time of people um, basically, you know, losing the generation of Israel's end generation, which is 20, uh, 1948. And if you're wondering, 1948 is really the limit of time before... 2048 is really the limit of time before we can leave and get... Um, the, you know, basically the second coming is the limit of time of 2048. But, but, but what about... Um, uh, 2031. Well, I believe that should be the limit of um, when people are raptured up because if it's 2032, if it's 2031 or 2032, basically the real limit is 2031 because all these things happening right now, as bad as they are, are going to only get worse if it gets to 2031. It's going to get extremely bad if it gets to 2031. So, um, we're going to have famines beyond famines if we get to 2031. So that's basically what I believe is really the limit. God has the limit beyond limits if it's 2031 and it's like his last uh, call. So if it's really 2031, um, I beg you right now, like this is not an option, to call out to the people who are lost, make YouTube videos, and tell people salvation. And this is what salvation really is before you go up in the rapture, before we get to, to any type of thing, before we get ahead of ourselves, you know? So what is, the, what is the salvation? It is really trusting in Jesus to get rid of all of your sins. All of your sins have been, you know, paid. Jesus paid for all of our sins, no matter what. Trust in that and then, what Romans chapter 9, uh, chapter, Romans chapter 10, verses 10 and 13 say, just call out, you know, call out to Jesus. Just accept him as you learn Savior. Just choose Jesus. That's all you have to do is choose Jesus. Basically, all you have to do is, you know, believe that he took all of his sins away and choose him at the same time. That's all you have to do. Call out to him. It's just choose Jesus. And, you know, Jesus took over, took all of our sins on, on, the, on, the, on the... Jesus took away all of our sins on the cross. He, he basically rose from, rose from the third day, obviously. And he's alive, actually. He's not dead. He he died and he rose again. So that's all we know. You know. So remember, choose Jesus because he's the one that he's the one that saves you. Not anyone else can save you. Not any other religion. Only Jesus can save you. Remember that. My last my last statement is choose Jesus. All right. I'll be done now. Okay. Bye.